One area of concern commonly flagged by people hoping to lose weight is their midsection. Many men and women hope to slim their waistline in their weight loss efforts. This desire is targeted by companies who promise to blast belly fat through the use of various diets, pills, and supplements. Some even claim to target fat loss in certain parts of the body, a concept known as spot reduction. However, one doctor has come out against the notion, branding the idea as another weight loss myth. Writing in The Conversation, Dr. Nick Fuller of the University of Sydney, Charles Perkins Center Research Program Leader, answers the question asked by many slimmers, can I actually target areas to lose fat? like my belly? As much as people yearn for a flat stomach, it's simply not possible to target fat burn in one area. Dr. Fuller explains our bodies are hardwired to burn all our fat stores for energy. That means when we exercise, we use up fat that is stored all over the body. So how can you whittle your waist? Dr. Fuller explains that our bodies decide where we store fat, and the places we lose it first. These factors that control this are sadly outside of our control, which are our genes, gender and age. Spot reduction is a myth, we can't control where our bodies lose fat. But we can achieve the results we're seeking in specific areas by targeting overall fat loss, writes Dr. Fuller. While you may not lose the weight in a specific spot when exercising, all physical activity helps to burn body fat and preserve muscle mass. This will lead to a change in your body shape over time and it will also help you with long-term weight management. This is due to the fact that how much energy we burn at rest, called the metabolic rate, is determined by the amount of muscle and fat we have. And since muscle burns more energy, people with more muscles burn more fat while resting. Dr. Fuller concluded, successfully losing fat long term comes down to losing weight in small, manageable chunks you can sustain, periods of weight loss, followed by periods of weight maintenance and so on, until you achieve your goal weight. It also requires gradual changes to your lifestyle, diet, exercise and sleep, to ensure you form habits that last a lifetime. Dr. Fuller also warned people to be wary of companies advertising pills and supplements as the best way to lose belly fat, pointing out that independent studies do not back these claims. Join the Daily Records WhatsApp community here and get the latest news sent straight to your messages.